For this Thanksgiving, you have to try this pineapple glazed ham. It's been a holiday tradition in our family for years. It's so easy to make, so let me show you guys how. Cheers. For this recipe, we're gonna begin by preheating our oven to 275 degrees. And for the ham, I'm gonna be using this Kirkland Signature Spiral Sliced Ham. This is our family's absolute favorite. We buy this every year. It already comes pre-sliced, and it also comes with this honey ham glaze. We love it. I'm gonna start coating the ham with some butter. Make sure you spread it everywhere. A good thing to know, it's better to have your butter at room temperature, that way it's easier to spread. Oh, and by the way, I'm using unsalted butter. Okay, make sure you coat it on all sides. We're gonna add pineapple slices, and I like to use toothpicks so it can hold the slices. And we add the pineapple slices all over the ham. We don't need toothpick on the top. Or oh, you know what, never mind, because what if it slides once the butter starts to melt? So, and we keep adding until we run out of pineapples. I'm using a total of two cans of sliced pineapples. Once we're done adding the pineapple, we're also gonna add the pineapple juice. So now we're gonna cover it with foil. Make sure it's long enough and that you have space. And also, be careful not to make holes in the foil with the toothpicks. This is an 11 pound ham and you cook it 12 to 15 minutes per pound. We put it in the oven. We bake for two and a half hours at 275 degrees. While we wait for the ham to cook, I'm gonna prepare the glaze. I set my pan on low medium heat. We add the glaze packet and one fourth cup of the pineapple juice from the can. Now stir constantly until it comes to a boil. It's been about two minutes, it's ready. I'm gonna turn off the heat and set it to the side. It's been two hours and 30 minutes and we're gonna check on our ham. Okay, we're gonna open it up. Honestly, it already smells delicious. Okay. We're gonna be adding some of the juice on top so it's juicy. Once you add the juice all over, it's now time to glaze it. This glaze, guys, it has such a good smell. I love brown sugar glaze. Reminds you of the holidays, Christmas, Thanksgiving. I love it. So make sure you get the glaze everywhere. So once you're done with your glaze, we're gonna pop it back in the oven. Increase the heat to 425 degrees and cook uncovered for 25 minutes. It's been 25 minutes and our ham is now ready. It smells so good. It's making me hungry. I grew up eating ham on Thanksgiving day instead of turkey. It goes just perfect with mac and cheese, mashed potatoes, a side of green beans, zucchinis. Actually, I love it also with um, Brussels sprouts. All right, guys, now for the moment of truth. Let me grab some pineapple and some ham. Cheers. Mmm. The ham is so delicious. And the pineapple gives it that little extra crunchy kick. It's so delicious. If you guys haven't tried ham, the one at Costco is my favorite. Try it, it's so good. By the way, guys, what do you prefer? Turkey or ham or... I've even heard some people eat chicken. I personally prefer ham. I mean, that's all. That's what we've always eaten ever since we were growing up. So if you've never tried this, you should definitely give it a try. And there you have it, delicious pineapple glazed ham.